project that is underway at Tottenham. Tottenham. At Tottenham. 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 Uh, if I said uh, you know after ten games uh, <laughs> there is a trend in the league. No, you ask me not a tricky question because I'm, I, I I like always uh, to say what I feel really uh, deeply. I believe Tottenham will be one of the contenders of, uh, for, for the league. What's impressed you about what Costa Cogli has done last week? I would say on the opposite, uh, they bought Madison, who is a great player, experience, and uh, who is that link from uh, low mid to high mid and uh, uh, added some technical creativity to the team. They bought Van der Ven, who I find terrific. exceptional. Terrific. I agree with you. I find absolutely exceptional. Yeah. And David Green, this is there. And, uh, uh, last year, we is not the best of seen as well. Yeah. So overall, and uh, the, the line from some into the middle uh, looks good. It looks very good. But you said one of the contenders yeah. for, for, for what? Top four, or are there for five or uh, genuine five for four? the Premier League? I would say Arsenal for me, uh, uh, Liverpool, Tottenham. City, of course, they will always come back. Uh, they will look the, the four who will fight at the moment uh, for the Premier League. After 10 games, what about Manchester United? Manchester United is a bit in the same situation than uh, Chelsea, I would say. Uh, they do, you don't have a guarantee that the, they can win, they have promised to create goal chances, goal, goal opportunities. They depend uh, goal scoring wise a lot on Rashford. And, uh, Overall, I would say there is no really strong defence uh, uh, up front as well. They have not found really the players they bought. Anthony, uh, Sancho, they, did, like, they cannot get in the team. They spend a lot of money for it. And uh, therefore, I would say not many people today would predict that Man United will uh, fight uh, to win the Premier League. Top four? Top four is still possible, but it will be tough because you have uh, the four I just uh, cited. More plus, possible or less possible? Plus, plus uh, Newcastle. And don't yeah. forget Villa. Villa, you have to count Villa. Mm. They can, uh, they look very good. 많은 전문가들이 토트넘의 우승 가능성을 언급하기 시작한 가운데, 벵거 역시 토트넘이 맨시티나 아스날, 리버풀과 함께 경쟁자로 직접 뽑은 것이죠. 벵거 감독은 1996년부터 2018년까지 아스날 감독을 하면서 3번 리그 우승에 성공했고 10개의 트로피를 올렸으며 828경기를 감독한 레전드 감독입니다. 특히 라이벌 팀인 토트넘을 객관적으로 우승 후보로 손색없다고 평가했다는 점에서 오히려 신뢰성이 높은 분석이라고 할수 있습니다. 메디슨을 영입한 게큰 영향을 주었고 수비진이 제대로 보강되었고 기량이 쇠퇴한 요리스를 대체했으며 손흥민을 중앙으로 이동시킨 것도 정말 좋은 선택이었다고 평가했습니다. 주요 영국 배당 사이트 역시 토트넘을 네 번째로 우승 가능성이 있는 팀으로 평가했는데요. 맨시티가 두배 이하의 배당률을 기록한 가운데 아스날과 리버풀이 4에서 5배의 비슷한 배당률을 부여받았고 토트넘은 그보다 다소 높은 8에서 9배를 부여받은 상태입니다. 지금까지 시청해주셔서 감사합니다.